One of the things that I love so much about Kildrys Castle is that there is like built-in processing like time and space into it. So as things sort of bubble up, there is a safe container for discussion and for asking questions. Oftentimes other types of queer art makers get really overlooked, especially by larger institutions. So for that reason, we felt really strongly about curating a group of lesbian identified women, non-binary art makers, and also trans men, artists and scholars, just to broaden the perspective of what queer art making and queer culture building and culture making can look like, um, especially here at University of Michigan. What we don't have here on North Campus is we don't have a lot of visibility around queer artists and art making. I think this is a, is a really overdue first opportunity for students to explore this part of their identity. I think it's going to be an infusion of like glitter into the bloodstream at a time that we need it. And I'm very excited about the students who will get to interact with these amazing people.